it should come as no surprise that exchanges are among the most well-liked categories of cryptocurrency startups, as traders are always searching for the best exchange with the lowest fees. Jupiter Station is one new system worth investigating. Best price, best UX, best tokens is the motto of this decentralized exchange, which has already garnered a lot of attention. So let's start with what is Jupiter Exchange? The Solana ecosystem serves as the foundation for Jupiter, a decentralized crypto exchange. Its goal is to replace centralized exchanges with a more efficient system that puts the needs of traders first. There is mystery surrounding the Jupiter team. They don't disclose much about their investors, development history, or backgrounds. Nevertheless, they have a lot of documentation for their project. The most important thing to know about Jupiter's past is that its development team is made up of ardent supporters of Solana, who have a lot of experience working with cryptocurrency exchanges. Okay, now let's examine how exactly does Jupiter work. The program is available to Jupiter users via the Jupiter app or the Jupiter Station website. The interface links you to a network of smart contracts based on the Solana ecosystem. Numerous other developers collaborate with the Jupiter Exchange as well. Jupiter offers five distinct APIs in total, including one for placing limit orders on swaps and another for real-time pricing. Jupiter functions as a third-party service provider in addition to being directly accessible to users. Now let's present features of the Jupiter. Swap. A range of tokens can be traded using Jupiter's swap aggregator. You browse the marketplace, locate tokens at the price you want, and set up a swap to take advantage of this feature. The swap system is configured to minimize slippage and fees. Routing techniques are among the many settings that users can alter. Limit order. Jupyter users can partially automate token sales with limit orders. Tokens can be purchased at any price you specified, and when the rate is met, the order is automatically completed. DCA. Another practical method of automating purchases via the Jupyter Exchange is dollar cost averaging. Users can program trades to take place at predetermined intervals over a predetermined amount of time. In essence, this enables you to buy or sell in bulk without being significantly impacted by changes in the market. Bridge. Token bridges are also made possible with Jupyter services. You can quickly move assets from one chain to another by switching tokens between chains. Perpetual. On Solana, Jupyter offers users a perpetual exchange. Maintaining market stability is greatly aided by this new ecosystem which moves tokens from liquidity pools to the trader. Additionally, it provides interested traders with leverage of up to 100 times. JLP Pool Through the Jupiter Liquidity Provider Pool, the exchange makes trading easier. If they so choose, users can contribute tokens to the liquidity pool. Liquidity providers receive fees from users in exchange for temporarily locking tokens while they are being used for swaps. LST Stablecoin. To help facilitate exchanges, Jupiter features the LST Stablecoin. This Solana yield bearing stablecoin is based on the US dollar. It can help with things like providing collateral for interest free loans. In conclusion, one of the most promising exchanges on Solana is the Jupiter Exchange. Its low fees and easy to use interface have won it a lot of fans. The JUP token has received a lot of favorable attention as a result of its popularity. JUP might be a thrilling chance if you want to invest in the next big thing. So, that's the end of this video. Now if you have found the content helpful, don't forget to give a like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this.